you're listening. Hey everybody, it's rahanavis 70 m here and I'm here to tell you about what you can expect from my channel over the next couple of months. Okay, first things first. Personally, the Patreonic Dalek's biggest fan is Dalek Bieber. If you check out her channel and watch her birthday special, you can see an exclusive clip by Percy the Patriotic Dalek and Boris the Broken Dalek that you won't find anywhere else. Unless, of course, I decide to upload it myself. In fact, why don't you tell me in the comments section, should I upload the full clip myself? Before I'd say anything, I just thought I'd let you know, don't expect too much from me because I am very busy. A-levels do require a lot of focus, a lot of concentration, a lot of dedication. But I am going to tell you the things that I am currently working on and plan to work on. Okay, next thing. I am currently working on a video concerning walking with dinosaurs. I loved walking with dinosaurs when I was a kid. I grew up with walking with dinosaurs. It is a huge part of my childhood. For those of you who don't know what Walking with Dinosaurs is, it is a six-part BBC and Discovery Channel documentary about the dinosaurs, but instead of the usual documentary we get the dinosaurs, it's presented in a National Geographic or David Attenborough-style documentary, as if the filmmakers have just stumbled upon some dinosaurs and filmed them. It uses CGI to bring the dinosaurs to life, and it's the first time CGI was used for television to such an extent. It is a really important series, it's been watched by 700 million people worldwide. It spanned a sequel series, Walking with Beasts, which looks at the rise of mammals after the extinction of the dinosaurs. A prequel, Walking with Monsters, which looks at the origins of life. Numerous specials, some of which featuring a presenter, Nigel Marvin. And also Walking with Cavemen, which looks at the evolution of humans, although I haven't seen that one myself, unfortunately. Also, an arena show, which I have been to see twice, and I can safely say is the most spectacular arena experience you'll ever have. Also a movie, but that did to Walking with Dinosaurs what Tim Burton did to Planet of the Apes, so I'm going to forget that exists. This year marks Walking with Dinosaurs' 15th anniversary. Although I'm pretty sure the anniversary was in April, I haven't got round to it until now because... Well, on the DVD cover I have, it says October 1999 was the original transmission date, but all I know is this year is the year of its 15th anniversary, so... I am currently working on a tribute to this series using clips from all six episodes, as well as one of the specials, because that's got some good stuff in it. And I've chosen the music, and it's finished. It's pretty much finished. It should have been up on Sunday. Why isn't it? Because Windows Movie Maker! Honestly! Looks like 20th Century Fox aren't the only ones trying to ruin walking with dinosaurs. This error means that I cannot save the video. So I'm having to save each clip I've used in the video independently and build it up again. Yeah, each clip is about two to three seconds long and the video is seven and a half minutes long so this is gonna take a long time but you should expect it to be up by the end of the year at least hopefully the end of this month gee thanks movie maker another notice is Percy the patriotic dalek fans can expect another big video featuring him soon i'm going on holiday to the south coast and hopefully percy will be coming with me i don't know about boris because of the amount of logic space but Percy will be coming along in a video that will effectively be a spiritual sequel to Percy the Patriotic Dalek Visits the Lake District, although hopefully with no caravans being blown up. So stay tuned for that. It will probably be up sometime around Halloween. You'll probably see more of Percy the Patriotic Dalek later in the year as well, but I don't have any really specific ideas in mind. I might also make a video in November, as the 22nd of November marks one year since the death of Draco. I'm thinking of making a video to commemorate that. Around Christmas time, you can expect an update on my Doctor Who collection, as the past six months have seen several additions to my collection. Those of you who've seen my video on the Impossible set will know at least one item, but there are other things that I'd like to show. And finally, around the beginning of next year, or the end of this year, I will be working on a top 10 
paleontological discoveries of 2014 because 2014 has seen huge paleontological discoveries. We've had whole new species discovered, some of which completely changed our understanding of prehistoric animals. We've had further details of old species discovered that have completely changed our image of them. We've had some new theories put forward. It's been a fantastic year for paleontology and considering that I actually really like paleontology and prehistoric animals, I want to commemorate that. So we can expect a top 10 discoveries of 2014 sometime at the end of the year. And that's all I've got to say. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Oh, and um, by the way, for those of you who are wondering, I've noticed some people have a hard time saying it. Rahonavis, 70M, is pronounced ra ho nay this 70 m Okay, just thought I'd let you know. Please like and subscribe. Goodbye.